What up channel, it's 4Play and this is questions from you, number 3. The map is cargo, the game type is search and destroy. Please bear with me on the gameplay. It's an 8-0 gameplay, however, it's really good and exciting the first 3 rounds, but everyone always quits out on me in league play, and I just needed a game to put this up. I'm going to end up going 8-0. Uh, pretty cool final kill cam, barely hit the kid, but I'm jumping off a building, whatever. Anyway, back to this. Questions from you. Uh, this series has been really taking off, by the way. I had tons of messages, as I told you, and I chose this one because I figured it could help a lot of you guys. It's a three-part question, and it's fairly long, so I'm going to go ahead and get into it. The KGMH says, Hey, Foreplay, I just started... I want to start this off by saying I'm a big fan. I have a few questions for you, but I'll, f I'll first start with me. I'm 15 years old. I live in Canada. I always wanted to be a part of the YouTube community, and I wanted to become a pro player. You could say it's my dream. I got a job and started saving money to the point where I now own an HD PVR, Astro A40s, and a nice monitor, even a nice computer, and I'm probably going to get a scuff. Which, those are all great products, and that's awesome that you're fortunate enough to have those, because a lot of people don't have those as we speak. Uh, now I have some questions. First, my parents don't like how much I game, and they think it's all pointless. What can I do? Any tips would be nice. Secondly, I'm brand new to competitive COD, so I don't know any strats or map knowledge, but I grasp that fairly easy and have learned a couple spawn chokes. I'm having a hard time finding a team because my name isn't really out there, and lastly, I can't find a role to play. So let's start with number one. Your parents don't understand you playing video games because they think it's pointless, and can you really blame them? Can you blame that your parents don't know anything about MLG or don't know anything about competitive gaming? They probably do think you're just gaming with your friends, sitting there in front of the TV for hours. And to be honest, if your grades are slipping or you're not getting your chores done, then you can't blame your parents for getting mad. So first and foremost, make sure you balance your time. I try to tell this to all my viewers and subscribers that, yeah, we're all in this competitive thing together, but you still got a life and you got to balance it well. So I'm going to start by saying, make sure you explain to your parents what competitive gaming is, what MLG is what other gaming tournaments are and I'm gonna recommend some videos show them like highlight videos of events also show them videos um, like any movies about competitive gaming for, the, for you guys out there that really want to watch a competitive gaming video I'm gonna spill you with a secret video um, not too many people know about it's called the frag movie um, go ahead and YouTube search that I'm gonna try to get rights to upload that on my channel because I feel that would be huge however I don't really know what I can do um, as far as copyright and stuff. If I can get rights to do it, then definitely you guys will love that movie. But it's like an hour long, so make sure you have time to do it. And also, just like tell your parents straight up. Say, hey, when you get time, can you please watch it? Because this is what my, my passion is. Gaming's a hobby just like um, anything else is, you know what I mean? Like some people play sports and some people sew blankets or <laughs> whatever the case may be. But yeah, so that's number one. Number two, I want to say... You, you need to find a role for yourself, and finding a role can be extremely difficult because you don't know, like, if you're new to competitive gaming, then you don't know what you're supposed to be playing. Find out what fits you well. If you're a slayer and you like to kill things that move and you're really good at setting up, like you have a post-up play style, then that means you should be a slayer. If you like to be support and focus on getting cutoffs and help your objective player, then you're support. If you feel your gun skill isn't the best, or you like to use an SMG and it's pretty good, then run OBJ because you can be really good. Some OBJ players have really guns, good gun skill and you can do that. So try to get a nice role for yourself. The third part of your question is going to be extremely difficult for me to answer because everyone asked me this question and that was, I'm having a hard time finding a team. You can watch these videos all day from me, but I can't get you on a team. Um, I can't do that for you just due to the fact that obviously I can't recommend you to everyone and it's hard for me to help every single person get a team. But I will say this. I can tell you that getting a team is going to be very difficult, but it's, it's out there. You need to go in the right direction. You need to get on GameBattles.com, go to the forums, the recruiting session, anything you can do. Same thing with 360icons.com. You'll look for any type of forum and try to find other players. Worst comes to worst, go into league play and message players that you play and ask them if they're looking for a team or looking to start a team. You, granted, you might get blown off by some and people tell you, hey, um, I don't want to be on your team. Some people might talk trash to you, but it's better than doing nothing and just sitting there. Those are, those are the key things. Like, Just try to, try to make it happen and don't be scared of failing because what's the worst that happens is he's going to talk trash and say no. Go into league play, find a team. Either way, this is questions, uh, questions from you, number three. I hope that you guys like this. And, yeah, keep submitting your questions. And I have so many to go. So I'm not going to keep doing tons of videos on this, but I'm going to try to space it out. I'm sorry that I kind of overwhelmed my channel with it. Either way, this is 4Play from the 4Play gang. You guys are the best. Keep dominating your game.
Peace. What's up, gang? I hope that you guys like questions from you, number three. This series definitely is about to take off, and I'm going to try to answer as many questions as I can. Even if you're scared to submit me a question, maybe listen to some of the other ones that I answer because a lot of you guys have the same questions. Hopefully, I can help you. Either way, this is foreplay, and I hope that you enjoy. Top left is questions from you, number one, where it all started. Top right is questions from you, number two. 